Well, girls in Gulf County are getting ready to strut down the runway. The Junior Service League of Port St. Joe hosting their prom fundraiser. News 13's Chloe Sparks joining us live in the Port in Chapel Hall to tell us more about details about the event. So, Chloe, what's different about this year's fashion show? Good morning, Chris. So yeah, here is where they are going to be having this event on Saturday. What's different is that in past years, the community was welcome to come out and pick out their prom dresses for free. These are all lightly worn or brand new dresses. But this year, it's actually going to be in the form of a fashion show. So there's going to be some high schoolers out here from the two local high schools in Gulf County, and they're going to be modeling dresses just like the one I'm wearing. And I'm not playing dress up here alone this morning. Here with me is Betsy and Leanna. They are both on the Junior Service League of Port St. Joe. And Leanna actually started this fundraiser. What made you start it? So we started this project three years ago after I'd been in the league a few years. I had seen a need for um, a bridge between high school and the Junior Service League, um, which you can join now as early as 16. Um, and so this was a chance for us to be able to make a lasting impact on the high school girls, make them feel beautiful about themselves, and give them a chance to have, um, have an experience that they might not be able to have. What all does Prom Project Runway include for these girls getting ready for prom? So they'll be able to, first we'll start with doors open at 10 o'clock Eastern. People can come in and start looking at our silent auction items. And then the fashion runway actually starts from 1030 Eastern till noon. Um, following that, we will keep the, live, the silent auction open. We have raffle items for those going to prom. That includes you know, hair, um, hair products, beauty services, corsages, things like that, donated by local businesses. And then um, any girls can come and pick out dresses until 5 p.m. Eastern. And they've got dresses of all many sizes here. They've also got shoes. They've also got accessories. They do say that they are looking for people to come and give these girls manicures, pedicures, do their hair, their makeup for prom. That is going to be at the end of April. So if you have services that you are willing to provide, then definitely reach out to Betsy. Her number was on the screen earlier and will also be on our website later today, mypanhandle.com. Let's get some of these girls out here now modeling some of these dresses for us this morning. They all go to Port St. Joe High School and they will be in Saturday's fashion show. Reporting live in Port St. Joe, Chloe Sparks, News 13, Panhandle Strong.